So which Unity version should you use? There are basically three separate types. You've got pre-release versions, you've got support versions, and you've got long-term support. Thankfully, how you choose them is very simple. The pre-release versions, these ones are basically on the bleeding edge of Unity. These are alpha and betas, these are potentially unstable. So for these, you pretty much should only use them if you want to intentionally participate in the Unity beta program. Then you've got the support versions. So these ones are safe and stable to use. These basically have the same level of support as the LTS versions. These include some new features and updates relative to the latest LTS. So for these, you can definitely use them in production. Right now, that's version 6.1. So if you are starting a game right now, it is perfectly safe to use this version. And finally, you've got the LTS or long-term support versions. So these have the maximum stability, they've been extensively tested, and they receive bug fixes for over two years. These also, you can use them in production, and right now this is Unity 6. So how you choose it is very simple. The simple answer, you use the latest LTS or support version. Either one of those is going to be perfectly fine. If you're literally about to release your game, like in one to two weeks, if so, then just stick with the LTS, just stick with whatever version you're using. But if you're more than two weeks away from release, I would say use the latest support version. And if you're curious about the naming scheme, this is how it's set up. So the first big part, this one defines the major version. Then we've got the minor version, so 6.1, 6.2, and so on. And the final one, these final numbers and letters, this basically is the hotfix version. You've got alpha, beta, and final. And when it comes to upgrading from hotfix versions, you've got no issues. So feel free to update from hotfix version 7 to hotfix version 10 or something. Those are never going to cause issues. Upgrading the minor version, that one might cause some slight issues. So I would recommend you do those if either you want to test out the beta version, to always do a backup before that. And of course, upgrading the major version, that one might cause some breaking changes, so always make a backup. But thankfully in recent years, Unity versions have been very stable. But thankfully in recent years, the upgrades have not been very difficult. Just a while ago, I upgraded the project from version 22 to version 6, and everything worked fine.